Hi, Barry Marsh here with the top three things that you need to know this week at St. Mary's. The number one on our hit parade is getting your vaccine. Come on, you got to do it. You need to do it. You know you have to do it because it's good for all of us. It's good for you and it's good for everybody at St. Mary's. So please get a free vaccine and enjoy fellowshipping at St. Mary's. So do it. Number two, Women's Day is coming to St. Mary's and it's going to be glorious. Imagine all the girls getting together with Jesus. Yes, on the 19th of August, it's happening. And uh, you know who else will be there? Reverend Patsy. There's even going to be a lunch provided. John Norris is going to be breaking out all the pots and pans and making sure that you have a good lunch. You're well fed, not only well fed in a physical sense, but you'll really be well fed in a spiritual sense. That's Women's Day coming up on August 19th, 9.15 a.m. to 3 o'clock. Sign up by calling the church. And here's the number right here. Do it and you'll be blessed. Number three, the National Altrea, our first ever, is coming to St. Mary's via Zoom on August 21st from 1 to 4 p.m. We'll be in Ross Hall. All the Kersiistas at St. Mary's are inviting five other parishes throughout our area. So come join us on Saturday, August 21st from 1 to 4. Doors will open at 1230. We're going to have light refreshments, a full coffee bar, and lemonade, iced tea, and water. So come and be refreshed with our first National Altrea with an opening statement from our presiding bishop, the Most Reverend Michael Curry. And those are the top three things that you need to know right here at St. Mary's Episcopal Church in Stewart for this week.